Hello, what's happening? What's up? This is not a hoax. Cutie by Das Noob, Love Wizard, Hundred Cotton, Esquire, Streether, Krabby, Six Fifty Four, Triple A. Hope you're having an amazing and wonderful day. We're going to be hopping into a Slug C run today. If we win this run, we have a ten win streak, which would be uh, pretty nice to have. So I'm hoping for a victory. Slug C also starts with the chain leader, just like the Lanius A last night. We'll see how it goes. It's a pretty nice ship. I think it has uh, hacking and mind control to start. Uh, it does limit uh, what other systems you can use. What's up, Symbol, Super Luigi, Sven, Goofling, Greg and Balto, Gritchnock, Destruction, Broken Spacebar, SU Pizza Girl, Destruction. Let's just hop right into the game. I'm ready. I hope you're ready to have a wonderful time. I'm ready. This is the run. Number 10. What should we name this fine vessel? See where we're at here on the uh, patron name list. Who's going to be our fine slug crew? Got Shadow Remix. We got a... What are you going to do here? Let's make you a, a gray slug. There we go. We got Spambo Jambo. I feel like Spambo always gets those slugs. Fellwalker. Doom Machine, thanks for the 100 bits, man. Cheers to you and congratulations on getting the NGA win and unlocking NGB. Good feels, man. Thank you for the five consecutive months of destruction. Appreciate you keeping a dapper, sir. And thank you for the 40 bits as well. Do, do, do. You know, Lethal Lemon sounds pretty good. I like it. Let's see what it looks like. That's pretty cool, right? I don't know if I've ever actually looked at the ship with the uh, the rooms hidden. It's pretty uh, pretty neat. I think we've used just about every banana-related name at this point, so... That's right, Spambo Jambo. Slug badge don't lie. Pretty smooth. All right, so we have mind control and hacking. Neat clone bay, three slugs. Everything's gonna be fine. Streether, thank you for the great half year, sir. Netrunner 383, thank you for the 29 consecutive months. And Tobias Funk, thank you for the great half year as well. Thank you all for keeping it dapper. Much love. All right, man. So this ship, just like all ships, is weak until it gets a second shield. And also is a very, uh, very weak weapon at 16 seconds for the first volley. After that, it's okay, but uh, we, we have to be hitting with our stuff, and we'll often probably have to hack weapons early in Sector 1, which is less than ideal. A good note about the Slug C is you do have the Slug Repair Gel to sell. I think they might sell for 30, at least 25. This does automatically repair hull breaches, but it's scrapped towards your, uh, your shield right away. I think I can go 1, 2, 3 three, four, five, and then over here. 
Maybe I should get a, a run at something at the store, or get shields at least. Okay, well, we're not going for achievements. No, uh, no point in not looking at them. What are the slug achievements here? Well, using the slug cruiser, I have vision of every room of the enemy ship without functioning sensors. So, just have to board the slugs and uh, get the sensors that way, since slugs see adjacent rooms. Jump to 30 nebula locations before Sector 8. That's not too bad. Disintegration Ray. While using the slug cruiser, kill three enemy crew members with one shot from the anti-bio beam. Nice. Virtual Viper, welcome to the Dapper. Much love. Thank you so much for that subscription. Do appreciate you. A little hand to you. The stress it is. Yeah, we can do this. Dude, I think this is three times in a row that we've won the giant alien spider event. Granted, we had the uh, clone bay all three times, I'm pretty sure. The last anyone, thanks for the 15 consecutive months. Much love. Nine scrap a doodle. That's not it's not a lot. Um okay. We have to attack the pirate here, but this uh, weapon system is problematic. I think the best we can do here is uh, hack weapons. I don't know about that. I kind of feel like we need to, to hack shields here and just kind of eat the volley. So many things can go wrong in this fight. I think it's gotta be weapon hack. Uh, gotta be able to reduce the amount of stuff lobbied at us here. So as soon as this fires, we're gonna start our hacks and regain our shield back. Okay, maybe a fire will start in here. Uh, no fire, but uh, something. Not weapons. Okay, shield's not great either. Nice. Well, Weapon Hack's going to save our bacon here, I'm pretty sure. Oh, yes, indeedy. Okay, now that that's down and we have our shield back up, we may have an opportunity for a crew kill here. We'll stop firing for the moment. Okay, he broke through the door. Good for him. He's trying to repair. That's fine. It's mind control. Okay, there we go. Fight, fight, fight. Um, I think you have one HP remaining if you're alive. Piracy cannot be forgiven. Yeah, let's wait for him to break in here to see if he has exactly one HP. I'm pretty sure he had 16 before. How's it going? All right, Grizzoli. Tough toenails, man. Look at that scrap of doodle. Well, there may be a chance we don't hit the store. I guess that's okay, though. Uh, the scrap line's been good here. It is casually shown, it's hard to kill the anti-bio beam with, uh, or kill three people with that. It is possible, though. The rebel ships, I think, have the, uh, the best, the best ones for that. Okay, cool. This worked out the way I wanted it to. Maybe 
man, buying Burris Lather here is pretty tempting, but I don't think it's right. Mr. Dahmer, welcome to the Dapper. Thanks so much for subbing with Twitch Prime. You are awesome. A little hand to you, friend. Thanks for keeping it down for the past 16 months, C Trigger MD. Much love. And we do get guaranteed hits with mind control. They're pretty, uh. Yeah, it was too early. Let's just buy our shields like a smart person. We even have the power for the shield. So now versus like a laser ship, we're totally fine. We still have hacking option, mind control option. Wow, I don't know about that. I'm obviously not gonna surrender my crew to slavers here, but dang. I guess if we can hit weapons here, it's gonna be okay, but if they hit my weapons, we just have a pretty bad time. Got a hold here. See some holding in the chat. I didn't even I didn't even pause to type that in chat. That's that's how we gotta do here. We're at mercy of the game. Okay, the weapons got hit, which means that the uh, it's also disrupted. So we have to wait for it to charge all the way back up again. 16 seconds for that to go back active. Wow. Um. Okay. Da, da, da. Thank you for not hitting weapons. Okay. Let me go ahead and hack this. Stop the madness. Yeah, look at that. It was just about to time out with the other volley. Let's not do that. No need to run here. I do want this reward. Okay, cool. It took the uh, took the flak down here. All right, we can load the O2 back up. Okay, as soon as he breaks in here, I'm gonna start the mind control. Forty-nine. Okay, this is fine. We'll uh, we're gonna mind control uh, this guy again, so he comes back in and fights. We're gonna drop uh, drop this so it doesn't lock him in there now. Okay, there we go. They're gonna fight each other. That's good. Okay, forty-nine twenty-two. This is good. We sh should kill him here, and then we can uh, pepper down the human. That's it, though. That's all we needed. Okay, I'm gonna destroy this four huts. There we go. That way his mind control is not gonna last. I think he had 29 health left, so that's exactly uh, two shots here. Wowza, wowza. Thanks for keeping it down for the past 28 consecutive months, Kilo Ron 1. You are awesome, man. Boom, bam, blammo. It appears the slaves did not survive the fighting. You find their burnt bodies in the hull. Before you strip the ship, you hear faint noises inside the walls. You break off a latch, and a slave falls out of a hidden compartment, coughing. Once recomposed, the slave offers to join your crew. Gimme that. Now, if we didn't get the crew kill there, we were not getting a crew at all. 
huge victory fourth crew and now we got a uh, maybe a training opportunity in our future hey we still need weapons and stuff we don't have an urn yet we just got the the makings of an urn Hey, Bad Micro, good to see you back. Welcome to the Dapper, man. Thanks for subbing with Twitch Prime. You are awesome. Thanks for making it official with Twitch Prime. Okay, let's attack the automated ship to get there. Well... My guess is weapon hacks probably not fast enough, or it won't do enough to actually reduce them. I think that's what we're gonna do. Uh, could also hack piloting and eat the first volley, but let's do it this way. Enjoy that humanitis, bad micro. As much as you can, you know. Life has never been better, Lunchbox. Hope you've been awesome as well. Okay, fair enough. Just not weapons. Whoa, there's no way a manas can do that. There's no way. Okay, let's have him bail over here, and then we'll uh, also bail over here. Begin the venting. Oh no. Okay, that's not what I wanted to have happen here. Glad we have the weapon hack now. Okay. Fire's out, O2's on. Let's open the doors, revent that, get everybody repairing the shields now. Weapon hack's gonna be up just in time. Wow, second time this game that uh, weapon hack has really saved us uh, a lot of damage. Or at least some damage, I feel. Investigate the station. Okay, nothing useful. That's all right. We've had a great run as far as uh, exploring and being able to find stuff. I think one, two, three is my best bet to get here. I guess we can go one, two. Ooh. I think I definitely prefer Medbay, Dawn of the Shrimp, though Clone Bay is inherently better. Uh, for doing wind streaks, Clone Bay ships are probably uh, a lot more kind, but. Uh, something about med bay and keeping your crew skill uh, at tops. I, I like that a lot. High risk, high reward. Though not being able to safely do a lot of events uh, uh, does hurt a lot. The events you use clone bay for, the risky ones where you can just reclone your crew, uh, are usually pretty beneficial, and you can't do those on med bay ships. Hot diggity dog. Thanks for the 45 consecutive months, Haji. Haji for the win. Appreciate you, sir. Thanks for being a part of the channel community for so long, man. It's beautiful. Let's get in there. All right, the ship can't damage me. That's nice. Nice, easy ship. Not good for training, though. Can't train shields off of ions. Skirples, thanks for the 22 consecutive months, sir. Appreciate you keeping it dapper, man. 
Lurker love, lurker life. Okay. Uh, I don't like that. I feel like I can go one, two, and make this jump, no problem, but can I go one, two, three, and then make this jump? Uh, debatable. been a great sector one so far, so I have nothing to complain about, but uh, we're definitely going to be missing some jumps here. Uh, good old reverse caps lock, Automaton. No worries, dude. Uh, in all, Duncan, the warning on the map is the rebel uh, fleet pursuing you. So if you end up behind this red line, you have to fight a harder than average ship for the reward of only one fuel. Yeah, it doesn't connect over. Could maybe go... Uh this jump, go Nebula, and then down. That's possible, though not likely. If we wouldn't wanted to commit to one dive, we could definitely uh, do some crazy stuff, but uh, I don't want to. Holy guacamole. Okay, we can't heal up this Manus. What's your HP actually at? 70? Sure, Doomwitch. Faster Than Light is the roguelike game of space exploration. You have to work your way through eight different sectors of randomly generated space, currently Sector 1 right now, on your way to a giant flagship fight. Uh, along your adventure, you collect scrap, which you can use to upgrade your ship's systems or spend it at stores to buy new subsystems, weapons, so on and so forth. There's all sorts of achievements and ship unlocks and whatnot you can get, but uh, if you lose any run at any point, you have to start back at Sector 1 with a new ship. We're currently going into, this will be our 10th win in a row if we win this run. Just don't even think about it. Uh, you go to the FTL game website, it's 75% off as well. There's no reason not to buy this game. Can't heal Manus because we don't have a med bay. We have a clone bay instead. So I have to heal him over time. Well, I have to kind of hope here that this works out the way I want. Hot diggity dog. Well, I think I'm going to steal a little bit of training here. Not too much. Baramir, thanks for the four consecutive months. Much love. Uh, Mook, I think 14 is my best streak. I honestly don't know that for sure, though. For me, win streaks are all about the the journey, not the, not the end result. We've had several good streaks, many over 10. Uh, Creeper Thread, I actually, after 300 hours of playing, uh, used the save editor to unlock the Crystal Cruiser. It's a little bit of a, in my opinion, unfair unlock. A lot of people get it really early on, but I, I tried really hard and never got it. It's much easier to unlock the Crystal Cruiser now using the Rock Sea ship. But, uh, most ships, if you already know what to say on the events, are relatively easy to unlock. Just got to find the event and follow the string. But a lot of these ship unlocks will have some requirements, like having sensors too, or med bay too, or maybe a crew teleporter, or a crew of a certain race, answering a question correctly on an event. Ooh. 
Oh, hey, here's a tip if you're looking for the uh, the Crystal Sector. If you play the Rock C and you rename your crew member Ruin, R-U-W-E-N, the Crystal Crew Member, if you find the Rock Homeworlds, it will highlight the uh, Hidden Sector event for you. That's correct, Breakthrough. This is the best training combo early on. Heavy laser fires at 8 seconds, which is 2 seconds faster than the other best weapon, which would be, um, let's see, basic laser. The only thing that could technically be faster is if the ship had only a single chain laser and it got uh, revved up to 3. Then you'd have 2 lasers every 7 seconds instead of 2 lasers every 8 seconds. We could maybe train weapons on the ship, but not really. Uh, what we'd have to do, let's see if we can do it. I don't think it's gonna work, but. We depowered after we fired one laser. Yes, we could technically train on this ship. But I'm not gonna take the time to pause like that. Weapons training, it just happens if you survive. Sharptooth JL, welcome to the damper. Thanks for subbing with Twitch Prime. Much love. You are amazing. All right, we're halfway on piloting and engines. Not too bad. Velden25, thanks for the 34 consecutive months, sir. Much love. Welcome to the damper. Thanks so much for subbing with Twitch Prime. You are awesome. Thank you all for the love and support you guys show me. It is my honor and pleasure to be here every single day. Just grateful to be here, able to share this experience. Thank you for making it possible with your time and support. You are wonderful. Good job, guys. Good job. We did, like, almost no training on the previous run, but we never ran into an opportunity like this. Training on two shields uh, is 30% faster. It does make two shields act like three shields in a lot of situations. Crisis 42, welcome. Let's say back to the damper. Thanks for subbing with Twitch Prime. You are amazing. Much love. All right, what we're going to start doing now, we're getting a little bit closer here. I guess we can drop the chain laser for this. Start uh, mind control in here. They got no med bay, no clone bay, no problem. So maybe three or four cycles on the uh, mind control would be good to go.
Arterines, thanks for the four consecutive months. Appreciate you keeping it damper. Much love. Slugs are pretty good, man. There's not really any downside to them. I mean, they're not particularly good at fighting or repairing or anything, but they do give the life form scanner. Uh, they can't be mind controlled. They're just pretty solid. Allow you to see adjacent rooms and nebulas as well, which is not to be underrated. Thanks for the two consecutive months, Akua Bit. Much love. Da, 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 da. Nice, got him below 60. That's four lasers till that guy's dead. Yeah, immune to mind control is great by itself. I agree. Okay, now we can drop uh, engines real quick. Let's power train the shield here. Da, 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 da. Couple more volleys and we'll start. Uh, Luna, again, we found the uh, we found the Manus via crew kill, and I believe uh, the pirate Zoltan ship. Yeah, it was the slaver event. It was a nasty one. Uh, heavy laser flak versus one shield. But we got the crew kill. Yeah, this guy just keeps blacking out and waking up, wondering where the the other crew is. Zawana, thanks for the two consecutive months. Cheering those slugs on. That's despicable. Five and a half more volleys. Da, 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 da. I was say, uh, FTL is 75% off all weekend on the FTL website. You're not going to find a better deal for this game. You also see the, uh, the breach trailer there at the store app or on this website. Pretty exciting stuff, but a long ways away. It's got to be patient. Exciting to know something's coming. Terramus 6, thanks for the 42 consecutive months, sir. Slug life supreme. Much love, man. All right, it's time. It's time. Uh, in all, Duggan, FTL is an easy-to-learn, hard-to-master game. I mean, I still learn stuff when I play, but uh, it's easy to grasp what you need to do. How to execute that, though. Whole different story. One more and he's done, though. Wow, only 12 scrap for that. Well, we got what we came for. We got, uh, we got training. I'm not convinced I should be doing that. Let's just go here and then over. I think we will make this in time. Thank goodness. Uh, Doc and try to rescue. Okay. Four hull damage isn't great. Ten scraps, okay, though. You basically netted two scrap from that. Nice. Yep, we're just missing the weapon now, Folsom. We're one weapon away from making this run sing. Destroy and loot the ship. They're just pirates. Uh, okay. Turns out they got a med bay and a 
missile launcher and a bunch of other stuff I don't like. I think you're right, Moo Cow. I think maybe sending crew would be better there. The reason why not is because it didn't occur to me. I'm a human being, make mistakes every single run. As always, uh, suggestions are encouraged in the channel. You're welcome to talk about game mechanics. If you would have done something differently, uh, just please state what you would have done. Game discussion, always welcome. Um, I mean, what do I even hack here? I guess medbay hack could be kind of juicy, though, right? If I maybe mind control a manis. Okay, good dodge. If I do one damage, it should take out the missile launcher, which is what I want. Okay, they both want in, so I'm actually going to let them in here. Close the door behind him and then hack. Okay, that worked out really good. Except for the fire in the engine room. Okay, that's, that's good. Okay, that's not great. Okay, if the rock has 150 HP, we had hit him uh, 10 times with lasers. Will I even make him go uh, to the med bay, I guess is the real question. Okay, I'm gonna mind control him here. He's fine. Everything's fine. I don't think we're getting our crew kill here. No, there's no way. There's no way. The start of that actually worked out pretty good. I mean, we got lucky that we hit the way we did. But... Killed off two crew just by getting the old manis there. What a fella. Alright, what's your training, though? Spambo Jamo, fully trained on engine. That's kind of uh, rough to give up that training, though. Um, Rather than give up the training, let's go ahead and sacrifice a little bit of health on two people here. Just get that breach done. Hey, so far, so good, Simcopter. XD, Regin, thank you for the 37 consecutive months, man. Much love. Appreciate that. Super long-term support. Legendary resubs tonight. Thank you all for being here, making the content possible. Whether you've been uh, sub since forever or uh, it's your first time tuning in, thank you so much for being here. Appreciate your time so much. Wow, that's pretty close. Glad it worked out that way. Sakun, welcome back to the Dapper. Thanks for something with Twitch Prime. And V-Guy, thanks for keeping it Dapper with Twitch Prime. You are amazing. Attack the Rebels. I'm ready. Well, here's another great example of no med bay, no clone bay, no problem. Maybe, maybe not, O'Brien. I'm sure there was probably some way I could have gotten a crew kill in that situation, but I think it was by uh, having a different strategy uh, from the beginning. It would have been more risky.
Also, rocks are immune to fires, so those are less consistent. That last crew was anything but a rock. We had an easy crew kill there. Easy enough. Pair that, humanitis. Nice. Crew will lose 10% of total training each time you clone them. Shall not. We did indeed go on a hike today as well. Hiking's nice. Okay, let's wait for that fire to burn him out of there so we can get a new a new target. Guaranteed hits. Let's steal the civvy supplies. Ah, it was vaccinations. Now I feel kind of bad. Okay, then. Let's let's look for survivors here. What's up, T Lek? Got a bad case of the humanitis there, I see. Well, do I want to take a nebula into uh, three green jumps, or do I want to take a green jump into three red jumps? Okay, I, I guess I guess I would rather get stuck taking uh, like a Zoltan sector sector four than I would getting forced into sector six nebula. Well, yeah, slugs are okay in the nebula. We don't have long range scanners. We don't have level two piloting yet. We don't have a huge surplus of fuel. I don't know. I guess we get sector six nebula no matter what we do. Yeah, this has to be the safer path. Uh, Sector 2 Nebula is not going to be bad. Maybe we'll get some sick crew gains or something. Sure. Hundred and twenty-four scraps, so I think we'd probably spend some of that. I need a store with a weapon. Thanks for the four consecutive months, Kaiser Soze. Appreciate you. A little hand to you, friend. Sure, Blood, of course. Thanks for being here, dude. Okay, so we're just gonna let him wail on engines there. That's good to know. I mean, I want to get the crew kill here, but I don't think it's going to happen. Okay, it looks like a Lado all the way. Yeah, not quite what I wanted there, but... What was the dude? Spambo was doing so good. He was finally healing back up. Okay, now when I mind control this guy, I'll head down there, right? Right. I'm gonna drop hacking here. What? I disagree. I disagree. 
Dear God, Lemming, it's an abomination. Yakrin, thank you for the three consecutive months, sir. You are wonderful. That's cool. Except for you know they're totally not getting away. Was that guy's name Magmar? I'm gonna find out here real quick. Ooh, five fuels on a bad deal. I'm gonna take that. Oh, too late. I think it was Magmar. Ah, uh, diggity dong. Things are the 52 consecutive months, Namikaze. Dang. That is that is quite a few, my friend. Thank you. Oh, they're definitely going to still burn there, Shamanic, that's for sure. Um, use a hacking part on uh, cloaking here real quick, just, uh, just, you know, just make sure. Yeah, of course. Good dodge. There we go. Okay. Might as well give him this cloak here. Can always disrupt the next one. Shouldn't be necessary, though. store is though you think it's over here maybe man if we don't end up getting a weapon at the store this run gets very interesting they made it through I disagree okay O2's cuts now we can close these doors again classic humanitis shuffle Orb. Well, I think it's a welcome back to the dapper. Much love. Thanks for that sub. You are amazing. And a little hand to you, my friend. Hey, I missed it. Broccoli. There we go. I'm pronouncing that wrong since forever. Good looking out, Terramus. Hey, there's that story I've been asking for. Let's go ahead and take that now. Hole's looking a little bit grim here. Oh, baby. Hole laser one's not the weapon I want, but it's definitely the weapon I deserve. Wow, we're in a really similar situation to uh, the previous run that we had like this. The last run had double chain laser, double hole laser one, and it was pretty good. Long range scanners are definitely going to amp our scrap up, though. It's going to buy that weapon now.
Right on, Brongoli. Well, thank you, thank you. So glad you could be here tonight. Okay, well, at least we're going to be able to uh, manage some scrap here, because I don't think I was going to take uh, this line over here without long-range scanners. attack that ship hey look at that they can't hit us well I'm not totally convinced I can hit them either though but one thing I know I can do for sure is uh, make them hit each other because no med bay no clone bay no problem hey tough nuggets glad you're feeling better man glad you're able to rest up and recover Yeah, it is smug sub. This will be win number 10 if we get there. Yeah, we'll win the fight eventually. That's right. Nice smug some frag help in the uh, the auto type. You're doing it right, sir. Are we weapon trained right now? I guess not. I guess this is probably going to be the one we weapon train on. All it's going to take is the defense drone getting hit once here to ruin this, but uh, I, I think it can keep up. Maybe not. Rich Nog, thanks for the 100 bits. Cheers to you. Yeah, that's not working out so good for him. <laughs> Nothing better than making humanitis take care of itself. I suppose so. It's definitely in my top five activities. Either way they die, if the fire spreads, they die, because the shields go down, then I slam them. Then it'll be two whole damage till that happens. Uh, eh. Every time we fire here, we're getting weapon training, so it's, it's not like we're in a huge rush. I wish I could see inside the enemy ship right now to see if that fire is actually spreading or what it's doing. Man, it seems like he's got a lot better shot at hitting uh, the laser going there. I'm not convinced the fire is actually spreading, though. Yeah, eventually we're either going to hit the uh, the defense drone or get a shot through, is my feeling. Ooh, that was close to getting him. Level 2 doors doesn't stop the spread of fire. It does inhibit the spread of fire, though. If he hasn't gone back here to repair, I think there's either still a fire or something else happening. There we go. 
There we go. There we go. One more. Exactly. Okay, if it was it was that way, they'd be repairing it right now. But well, we got that defense thrown up finally. Well, the scrap gains look pretty great up here. Fight, 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 fight. I'm gonna drop a part here because I do want to... Uh, I'd like to knock a hit by missile. I think level two hacking would be a really smart call right now. But I, I need to save up to buy this weapon slot here. It's the most important thing. It's gonna be 65 to make that happen. Oh, I thought that was going to kill him. Okay, 68 HP. That's plenty. No problem. Hey, the crew kills have been awesome so far this round. Oh, you're going to crispy critter. Keep it crispy, man. It's Okay. No, as long as exactly 60 to get it. Let's do that then. I think this is definitely the right choice. Regardless of what we find at the store, we at least have a way to have four lasers now. That's huge. Thanks for the host, DJ Conjo. Hope you had a great show. Thanks for the 25 consecutive months, Armor 41. Much love, man. Two years in a month. It's beautiful. Hi, Filling. Thanks for the 300 bits, man. Appreciate your generosity. And Mini Junes, thanks for the three consecutive months. It's a bonanza. Well, Ottawa's Prime Minister, right now we're not going to be able to deal with Super Shields. Luckily, we're only in Sector 2, so we have uh, five more sectors and the rest of this sector to go to get uh, something to deal with the Super Shields. But right now, we can't. We definitely can't fight the flagship right now. No way, no how. Board and investigate. Okay. Well, uh... Alright, you can hang out in here too, I guess. Keep that human eye contained. Repugnant arm the weapons. Can't just go around calling people repugnant, sir. Okay, I'll just go all in it to win it here. Slight case of the humanitis, that's right. Okay, well at least we had the backup there. Bummer. Wow, he's just completely ignoring the mind control. He's like, whatever about that. It's all good. There we go.
All right, do believe we got it covered. That was a interesting fight, not really fun. Boom, bam, blammo. No crew, no crew kill there. Rocks are tough. 150 HP. Good job, Rockman. I think so, Nana Spider. If you could direct the mind control, it would probably be way too OP, yeah. It's already pretty great. There won't be a next time. Open fire. Um, okay, I'm gonna mind control this guy. You guys go tough it out there. What is what is happening right now? They don't know what to do. Oh man, it's gonna be freaking glorious. You're done, sons? Grommel 9001, thanks for the four consecutive months. You're awesome. Thanks for keeping it dapper with Twitch Prime. Appreciate you. Um, I could maybe get away with that. Let's not do that. Let's get out of the nebula into some new tunes, huh? What's your specialty? You could upgrade my sensors. I'm a slug ship. I don't believe in sensors. Uh, no engineer for the NG sector. That's kind of ouch. Maybe civvy sector is just overall better. Let's go civvies. If we have an NG already, then I'd absolutely go engineer control. But this looks like it's going to work out real good. Also, uh, civilian sector has pretty A-plus music in my opinion. All right, guys, I've been streaming for just over an hour. We're going to take a uh, short break here, about three minutes. It's going to stand up, uh, stretch, refill my water, uh, do all that stuff. Encourage you to do the same. There'll be no advertisements for this break. But if you do any shopping on Amazon.com, please consider using the Amazon affiliate. All you have to do is enter through uh, those links at lethalfry.com slash alinks.htm and do your normal shopping. Easy peasy. Thanks for your consideration. We'll return shortly to hop into uh, Sector 3. I gotta say, we're looking pretty decent right now. Before we break here, I'm definitely gonna buy these two power bars. We want those. Nice.
All right, guys, thank you so much for your patience during that very short break. Breaks are so important. Man, the amount of missile launcher ships we've run into this game have been pretty intense. Uh, I think our next purchase should definitely be Hacking 2 so that we can alleviate some pressure. Um, yeah. Bat Pup, welcome back to the Dapper. Thanks for subbing with Twitch Prime. Much love. Well, dang it. What are we going to do here? Well, they're also trying to get away. That's, um... It's less than exciting. Okay, what I think what I'm going to do is hack weapons here. We need this first volley here, so we're going to mind control piloting and slam shields with the first volley. If only I would have invested in level 2 there. Surely that little extra bit of dodge helped out is all the difference. Really? Oh, I should have hacked there. Okay, I think we're actually looking okay here. Yeah, that's good. Now if I also hit weapons... There we go. We actually shuffled the repair there, which is exactly what we wanted. Mind control. This guy that was repairing, that stops that repair again. So they have to send a brand new person up there to repair. They're not going to do that. The last. Thank you for the 34 consecutive months. Much love. Two away from that subscriber hall of fame. Appreciate that support. Everything went better than expected. What did we get? Three or four missile dodges there? Pretty nice. Elusive. Thanks for the six consecutive months. Much love. Uh, looking forward to that manus life. I can't blame you. Don't we all aspire to be more than just humanitis? Manus are pretty cool. I want to be a slug myself. Slug's got that telepathic ability. Got those sick mind control strats. Okay, in this case, we're going to hack piloting here. I want to make sure these weapons go down. Hopefully, it doesn't hit weapons here. Good dodge, good dodge. Yeah, it's not going to weapons. That's good. Also, not hacking. That's great as well. Okay, we got the breach too. We heard that beautiful breach noise. That means that this automated ship will never be able to repair those weapons back. We're 100% safe. Now we can uh, dunk the cloaking and uh, take the piloting out with the final volley. Might as well just wait here. Let's seal the deal. Got the breach there too. Hey, Metal Thung. Well, thanks for lurking, man. Glad you enjoy FTL to wind down the day. Me too. 
Okay, there's a store there. It hurts a little bit to let go of these nebulas, but I think I'm going to, so I can take one, two, go to the store here and have uh, probably a pretty great pickup at that store. Or we could just end up buying Hacking 2, you know, like we probably should have already. But now that we've seen the store, I want to take the next two jumps. Nothing to sell. Let's hold on to our 64 scrap here. Hey, congratulations, Xtor. Um, okay. I mean, <laughs> I'm not gonna surrender the crew to the slavers, though. That is pretty scary. I'm gonna not surrender, though. Well, no med bay, no clone bay means there's definitely a possibility of a crew kill here. Uh, our priority is obviously disabling their weapons. We, we have to do that. benefit from the shield training here. I think the shield training might come in super clutch. Okay, those both hit us nice. Um... Mind control piloting with the next volley. Wait on hacking here, I think. Let's start this right now. Well, three seconds. Three. Let's go make them fight each other. That's good. Fight, fight, fight. Um, okay. Also got a breach. Unfortunately, that's the last weapon left. That's not what I wanted. The breach will be nice, though. Okay, he had to leave the room. That's good. He's also not repairing, which means they're both very low. And mind control them. One of them are going to die here. The champion. Wow, with one HP remaining. What a legend. I'm glad we could witness that amazing fight. Um, okay, but hold on. They're already dying here, so I think maybe surrender is not an option. I think we get a crew anyways. Uh, I know for sure that was the killing blow, so... As much as I'd love a rock, we're going to say no. Because now we get a choice. And instead of taking a rock, we're going to take an engineer. Because engineers allow us to uh, do some cool stuff. Hey, Pickle John, there's never any schedule for when things will be played on my channel. We just kind of go with the flow and see where the night takes us. So sorry to disappoint, but I don't have any answer to when Isaac or any other game will be played uh, on the channel. Right now, I just want to have the best Slug C run that I possibly can. It's turned out to be a doozy. Cruise sorted. <sighs> T 
Tickle Squad at the ready indeed. I mean... Welcome back to the damper. Much love. Thanks for that support with Twitch Prime. You are wonderful. And a little hand to you, friend. Much love. Um, okay, I'm gonna attack the slayers. I may regret this. They do have a med bay, but we we know we know this works out for in our favor here by hacking here. Let's do this, and then mind control. The Manus. Nobody cares that the Manus is going ham on weapons. That is... I, I'm not gonna lie. A, a bit a bit disappointing. Okay, why are they going in here now? They didn't actually get hurt, did they? I think there's fire in there or something. Let's drop this real quick. Then, uh... Make them toasty? Okay, I didn't quite work out the way I wanted. Not even close, really. Vicaria, thanks for the 43 consecutive months. Much love. Okay, we definitely, uh, it didn't go as well as I wanted it to. Mind control here. Let's go for the shield so we can actually get the volley we need to take down that missile launcher. Dude, they're all clumped up right there. I mean, this is it, right? Oh, the door was. Oh, he tried to come out the other door. Oh, my goodness. Uh, I want to, but I'm not going to. I worked too hard on that fight. Yes, indeed, Detri Dune. If there's any uh, developer, I would instantly buy a game just because of previous games, it would be subset games. While the Breach is a very long time away, I look forward to playing it. But I'll have to be very patient till that time. It's a long ways. You know, subsets has uh, shown one thing is they'll take the take the time to release a really high quality polished game. What more can you ask for? Okay, but if you die there, you know, uh, T Lack, I gotta give you some props there. That's ballsy. Cause you know what happens if uh, that goes down, you're done. Well, I mean, we should probably test out the clone. We haven't cloned anybody this run. Why not T-Lek? Hot diggity dog. Thanks for the 43 consecutive months, Vicaria. You are wonderful. Thanks for being a part of it for uh, the past 43 months. Yeah, I wish, man. 
This is not the store I was looking for in Sector 3 here. But we do have uh, hacking for lasers here. I'm going to buy uh, level 2 hacking and 2 power bars, and then I'm going to buy some repairs. And one fuel. Have a good day, sir. Automated reloader is good, can you type, but when you're playing on hard mode, 40 scrap is a lot to give up. That's, you know, 40% of getting your, your third shield up. Normal mode, worth it probably more times than not. Hard mode, not so much. Uh, Muakao suggests have an NG sit in weapons room. Um, I, I like your idea of having the NG protect the remote area of the ship. And I think I am going to make an adjustment to where my NG is sitting. But the reason we're not going to have the NG sit inside the room with the slug is if we run into a ship that has mind control, um, the mind control can happen right there on the weapons room, which breaks him being uh, training on weapons. So I think we're going to have the, uh, the NG sit down here in a little more neutral location. I think down here works better. Who cares about this stuff? Not me. Generally speaking, you don't want to stack crew, but we're going to make an exception for our humans because you never know when you got to, you know, just vent the humanitis real quick. Yes, this was a drill. See, they're on top of it. They're ready. They're prepared. Have some faith in those humans. What the fudge? Why would you do this to me, game? It's just mean. You know I don't have anything to sell here. That's pretty rough. Oh, we know we're not getting scrap for stuff. We're gonna go. We got level two hacking though. Let's get in there. Three lasers and a fire drone. Challenge accepted. I know what I'm gonna buy instead of going to a store. I'm gonna buy my third engine. Like a responsible captain. Well, mostly responsible captain. do like an eggplant parmesan ragnarok i know i like the flavor of eggplant personally even just like sauteed it's pretty good not a vegetable i eat too often but definitely enjoy the flavor well they did just give me a beam too so i could get something at the store huh Ooh, like a, like a charge laser? Maybe like a halberd beam with hacking. I think that's too much into offense right now. As painful as that sounds, we gotta rally on our hacking here. Uh, 
da, 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 da. I don't feel good about any decision at the store. I do feel good about grabbing my third engine right now. It's only sector three. Let's not let's not panic here. We do have four lasers uh, with hacking and mind control. We got some creativity we can do. I want to get another weapon, but I don't really want laser charger. The problem with getting halberd beam is we have to get another 50 to get weapons online to have anything go with the halberd beam. Yeah, uh, I'm trying to think of good ways of uh, prepared eggplant when I worked in kitchens. Uh, definitely uh, soaking them in salty water, even putting salt on them and rinsing them uh, the next day. Uh, definitely done both of those. Depends on the preparation. Good grilled as well. I don't like my options here. I, f I feel regret going to the store, like I, I just should have passed on by. Hacking stun is pretty sick. I will give you that. You can try something really risky and sell one weapon, buy halberd, and save for weapon upgrade. Is that better than three engines, though? Mm. Yeah, I'm just going to save here. Uh, I might regret this, but I think buying third engine... Don't even need to buy a power bar for that right now. Can always shuffle O2 for mind control. Leaves us a good chunk for the next store. Three engines are the right choice in Sector 3. We don't need to extend further, though we want to. I just get really freaked out because we had that uh, stealth B run on the last streak where we didn't find any weapons all the way through Sector 8. We found the Sector 8 store, too. Hey, Sim Goddard, thanks for the 100 bits, man. Cheers to you. Glad I could make your weekend better. You are awesome. Okay, they hit me with a boarding drone. This is the human's job right here. We'll plop the manis in here as well and open all doors. This will stop the O2 from draining out of that room uh, as fast because it's draining from the entire ship instead. And then I missed my uh, missed my hack timing there. Whoopsie daisy. Okay, another breach is definitely not good. Now we're going to close this door off because that caused the problem. Double breach will pull the O2 out uh, incredibly quick. Okay, double fire in there is going to help. Now we got it. Keep it crispy. Please stop, boarding drone. Okay, there's no way we can defend the clone bay here, so I think our better option is... We got 22 L 77. Okay, uh, he stopped. Good. Uh, I'm not going to let him out yet. Let's go ahead and mind control this guy in the shields. Oh, he moved to the engines. What a guy. Thanks for the 21 consecutive months, Spiritual Prophet. A little hand to you, friend. Much love. Oh, I think this is it right here. 27, 23. Yep. That's it. So 
Ace Webcrafter, little hand to you. Welcome to the Dapper, and thanks for subbing with Twitch Prime. You are amazing. Thank you so much, everybody, for all the love and support you show me. And holy hope to give back as much in return. That's tough, though. Let me tell you, I'm so grateful for this uh, opportunity to be here entertaining you all. Uh, 19 scrap reactor upgrade. Okay. Okay, that was actually a pretty good deal. Yeah, we got Breach and Columbia, you're right. Um, yeah, neither of them have training. It, well, I mean... I mean, I think the slugs see an opportunity to make some money off of this breach. Let's, let's have a meeting here, the original three crew. Okay, the slugs have decided to start a betting pool here to see if the human can repair the breach before uh, 52 health expires. Everybody else in the show, including the other human. Let's see what happens. Fellwalker stands to profit the most if they do repair it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Whoa! Well, almost half, so not quite. Good try. You've also been wanting to test what happens when a clone enters a clone bay with no oxygen. Do they have uh, O2 in their lungs from the cloning? It looks like it. Good, good job, Aisha. Well, Fellwalker lost everything. Bummer, dude. Thanks for the 16 consecutive months, Sam Rolkin. Much love. Thanks for that kind message as well. Appreciate you. Okay, what did I say we were going to get locked into here? Zolt and controlled, right? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right, that is definitely a pulsar. I think we're just going to avoid that altogether and maybe have a nice cruising good time over here. Interesting. All right, let's go here. This is tough. Do I wanna do I wanna hack here? What do I wanna hack? I can hack weapons to try to get uh, the missiles down. I can really get the crew kill quite easily here though, I feel. Let's do it. Probably should have waited a second on that, but I didn't. That's a big boy missile. Okay, breach is nice, but that's probably also a breach. Huh? Wow. Well, that happened. Okay, we're definitely going to drop the hack here and then uh, boost it back up. Start the hack. O2 is still draining. Oh man, do I make it in time here? I don't think so. Not quite. Hey, we dodged it. Good job. 20 HP remaining. We got this. 
AZ, we're currently in Sector 4. The start of Sector 4, actually. Get back to your stations, lazy scallywags. Back to the doors, humans. Well, that's a pretty promising store opportunity if we take two these two more jumps here. You jump just in time to witness a Zoltan ship's FTL drive overload. In his final moments, their captain implores you not to get involved, but it's too late. Their attacker is already upon you. Whoa. We also sometimes name uh, crew after people in chat. Not every time, though. Officer Poppy, 7318. Thanks for the 105 bits. Cheers to you. Thank you so much for being here tonight. Yes, Ben Prenti is making the Breaches soundtrack perceptions. All right. I kind of want to mind control the manis. My feeling is that they won't fight there. Let's mind control. Mind control here. Okay, nice. I got us a two on one situation. Funny little dude. Thanks for the three consecutive months, man. Thanks for keeping it dapper. I'll do it. Anything to potentially maybe avoid damage. Also, we're putting a hurting on him here. I was hoping he wouldn't die. Nice. Well, he's definitely dead now. That's good. Can also mind control the manas now. Okay, nice. We got the missile launcher down. That's great. That's actually not good. It's probably going to pull the missile launcher back up. Okay, yeah. Fight, fight, fight. That's what I want. Okay, there's one guy down. He's trying to repair weapons. Good. We're actually at the crew kill here. Amazing. Okay, asteroid field's not so bad. Store being here is also good, so we can get both of these stores and get back through the nebula. I don't really want to give these up, but I know if I go that way, we're not going to get these stores. Let's, uh, let's follow the line that has potential weapons. Hey! Three shields would be awful nice right about now. Okay. Could have been worse. 
always hard mode on the stream. It's not, we're not playing on hard mode. It'll be uh, really clearly labeled somewhere in the title. We're currently on a uh, nine win streak going into 10 on random ships, Slug C. Okay, that could have gone a lot worse. Yeah, small bomb's no joke, but uh, oh man, that just fired too. Okay, that's not good. So that small bomb goes off, uh, the ion's gonna be behind it. Just make sure that laser doesn't fire. Could try to hit drones here, but I think weapons is overall uh, safer. <laughs> Yes, much safer. Everything's gonna be fine. Uh, is crew kill possible here? I don't think so. I guess anything's possible through the power of imagination, though. Okay, yeah, you can go in there. That's good, you guys repair together and then I can damage you together. I actually wish I could let them in there right now. Da -da -da -da. Wow, we're actually getting the crew kill here. That's very surprising. Hey, what's happening, Simply Mordor? Great to see you, man. Hope you're having a wonderful evening. Yes, I do. I definitely drop shields to let the ion pass. It is a totally legit strat. Uh, I kind of think I just want to go to the next store and try to find another weapon and we can buy cloaking here could also get a defense drone but four lasers is not going to hold out for much longer I think we have to wait for that next store defense drone is looking good but uh, if, again need the offense to back it Four laser is going to be uh, very bad versus three shields. Uh, okay. It's kind of like a really terrible choice. Okay. No, I don't think it's Ion Bomb here. I think it's actually the Laser Charger. We do have 34 missiles, but Ion Bomb is so slow at 22 seconds. If we had Cloaking as well, then the Ion Bomb is better. The problem with the Ion Bomb is if the Ion Bomb misses, you're out for another 22 seconds. So 44 seconds uh, in total to fire the second time. Elazian, thank you for the 21 consecutive months. Much love. Thank you for keeping it dapper. A little hand to you as well. I mean, I feel that's my best option right now. Does get me up to six lasers, so it's not terrible. We're also getting a five laser volley at uh, 16 seconds rather than a four laser volley. 
we could add like a heavy laser one into this with the hacking, that'd be just about right. Right on, Kate. Things are taking me in your travels. What's up, Ark Insanity? Minecraftian. We were just having an absolutely amazing evening. So happy to be here on the Saturday. Okay. Um. We're going to save up for three shields is our first thing we're going to get before we even buy a reactor power. Intruders on board, indeed. Okay, we got a manis problem. I really see the only, uh, the real option being here to hack shields and try to slam weapons and maybe mind control inside of there. I can mind control these guys, but I want to get, uh, maybe the crew kill here. They have two pretty weak weapons, so it shouldn't be a big deal. Should be just fine. Don't worry about those humans. They're having the time of their lives. If they tell you otherwise, just tell them to get back to work. Okay, we started a fire in there as well, which makes me happy. Okay, they're also uh, damaged beyond repair there. That's good. Silly Manus, there's no way you can put out those fires. Inconceivable. My only regret is I can't fully see what's going on over there because we do not have the sensor system. We'll just have to use our slug crew and our imagination. Alright, there we go. And now we mind control one of these guys. Fight to the death. Okay, he's gonna go back through this fire, right? Just try to save it. Yeah, that's right. Who's up next? Wow, man, that is, uh, that is pretty cool. You find a weapon system on their ship with no crew to stop you. You can install it on your own. Indeed, we can. If nothing else, that's a nice chunk of scrap for us. Probably our in-game weapon, though. More than likely. Let's have a little tea here. Yeah, good thing I didn't buy one. Well, honestly, double halberd uh, level 3 hacking one-shots most ships. Not all, though, and the ones that it don't is pretty scary. Well... You did your best. 
Do an awesome married viewing team. Thanks for being here. Okay, we don't need level two piloting because we have clone bay here and adequate crew. If we lost something that wasn't a human, that'd be not ideal, but could live with it. All right, to get two more into weapons here, let's see. Well, I guess we do have the option of doing chain laser halberd beam with the hack. Should I guess whole laser halberd beams better for the single volley. Do, do, do. Just see what happens. I'll secure the fuel. Okay, I need one shield here. That is a most diverse crew indeed. Let's mind control the weapons guy and see what happens. Nothing, they just don't care. Well, knowing that, we could have handled that better. I guess we can't uh, mind control the slug. Wow, double fire though, that's pretty intense. Wowza, wowza, please don't. Whoa, okay, okay, I see what's happening here. I don't like it. Wow, that that was uh, that was pretty not okay. Hydro, thank you for keeping it down for the past twenty eight months, sir. You are awesome. Do appreciate you. Okay, we're alive here, right? Let's see what happens if we mind control this guy. Who's left to defend here? Hey, I'm glad it helps you relax, man, Jill. That's what I'm here for, man. No offense taken whatsoever. If you had told me when I first started my career that people would mostly use me for background noise and help me relax or even falling asleep. I thought you were crazy, but uh, I'm so happy things turned out the way they did. I mean, I'm gonna take two more before this one. One, two. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I guess on a good note, we got some free healing.
You arrive at a Zoltan security checkpoint set up the perimeter around the beacon. A traveling vessel. You will submit to crew profiling to identify fugitives of the Empire. Uh, okay. I think maybe I should just attack him here to get the free scrap, right? Well, quote-unquote free. It's going to be a Zoltan fight, so it could be kind of painful. Um... I wonder if the slug event here actually gives you anything, or we just get to let go. FC Burns, thank you for the five consecutive months, man. Much love. Hmm. You get scrap for the slug one? Okay, let's check this out. Uh, you know, fuel. I don't think I've ever read this one, so let's read it here. You give the guards permission to dock with the ship, but before they come on board, your crew slowly advances to meet them. As far as you can tell, no words were exchanged, but the guards offer you some supplies and say the ship checks out. Best not to ask questions. That seems like something a slug would do. Yes, intervene and defend that outpost. Okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's unlikely that even goes down, but it's possible. Yeah. Wishful thinking. Right in the humanitis. Come on now. Ouch, man. Ouch, man. That's definitely not great. If everybody repairs here, maybe... I'm gonna go uh, whole laser here. I'm not gonna run from this fight. I'm gonna wait here. I think we got this. We're really so close to disabling the ship fully. It'd be a shame to run away now. Yes, they do hurt though. Wow, are you kidding me? Maybe we will jump away. Now, I gotta hang in here for one more. We got this, right? Surely this is the one. See? I knew we could dodge one. Just had to have a little faith, that's all. Not out of the woods yet. Hessian X, thank you so much for the 1,000 bits. I'm glad the uh, stream helps you fall asleep each night and unwind. It's beautiful to hear. Appreciate your generosity. Well, that did put a, a real damper on the hole. Okay, nice double reward there at least. Um, let's go into Pirate Controlled Sector 5. Yeah! 
Oh, no early store for us. Seems like a no-brainer to me. Welcome to the damper, Coffee Mortal. Thanks so much for that support. Via subscription, a little hand to you, friend. to see. preemptive GG's. We did recover from one hole earlier in the streak on the Zoltan B. And it looks to me like this is actually going to work out pretty decent. Uh, it's a decent deal, but no. I worked too hard for this one. Let's mind control this guy so that the repair never goes bad. And it's one of the most important things if you want to be uh, a good FTL player is being able to not lose your cool when things are going bad or you have low hole. There's almost always a way to recover. All right, so we're just going to wait for the next cloak here, and we'll start our hack uh, right about now. Hey, cool, Karotonic. I'm really glad you're able to find some streams to watch inside of that uh, relaxation community. Definitely found some more streams myself. I was able to host a new stream last night uh, because of the relaxation community. Great to hear. I mean, I may have started the uh, relaxation community, but I don't want anybody to feel like uh, I own it or anything. It's uh, Everybody's to use. A lot of people use Twitch for relaxation. That's what it's all about. Found lots of chill streams myself uh, over the past couple days just browsing there. Well, distress seems, you know, good, but if we take the distress, we're less likely to see a store, which is... Okay. Let's take this distress. Right now, I'm worried about seeing the most jumps possible, because I just like to get to a point where I can uh, repair. Let's send crew in. t has gone. Don't worry, we just cloned him. Good job, t -Lec. They said you were a good cloner, and they sure were right. You cloned up real good, bud. I mean, I prefer not to take fights right now, but I need scrap badly. Alright, we've got to risk it for the biscuit here. Oh, we could sell a weapon right now. We could do that. 
Okay, they're trying to hack engines here. That's not not ideal. Dang, this is actually really rough. Uh oh, spaghettios. Uh, I think we have to counter hack here because I do need my engines badly. An Artemis too. All right, I think we're gonna have to take a shot in the dark here and uh, see if we can damage it down. Uh, it's unlikely. We can still dodge here and get away in time. Not quite. It's close. We got the fire there. Okay, one dodge, one time. Down she goes. Hey, no hard feelings on my end. That was a really fun streak. We couldn't quite get to uh, double digits with it, but... It's all gravy, man. What a good run. Twitcher Rooney, thanks for the five consecutive months. Much love. The one thing I really appreciate about FTL, and I say this every time we lose a streak or lose a run, is that it continues to be uh, challenging even after almost 2,000 hours of play. That weak chain laser finally did us in there. Uh, I think maybe buying the burst laser one early on in that run would have led to a different result. I think that once again solidifies that Buying the first weapon you see is almost always correct when doing a win streak. First laser one would have uh, fit a lot better. Mole UK, I believe that is a welcome back to the damper. Much love. Thanks for that continued support. Hesse, and thanks for the 100 bits. And Politely Evil, thanks for the 1,000 bits. Thank you all for your generosity. Matt Hetzner, welcome to the damper. Thanks for subbing with Twitch Prime. You guys are absolutely nuts. You guys are celebrating my failure here. I'm okay with that. The way I see it is uh, you're more than welcome to uh, laugh at my failure, but don't root for it. It'll happen. It'll happen naturally, I promise. Yeah, we could have gone uh, in for Halbert earlier as well. Notch, thank you for the five consecutive months, sir. Hope you've been awesome, man. Vivog Dragon Slayer, thank you for the 70 bits. Unbelievable. Hey, it was a good run. That was fun. I don't feel like I made any uh, majorly critical errors on that run either, so I'm pretty happy with that. Probably could have uh, ran away from that missile launching ship and extended a bit. Lots of little decisions could have maybe led to something different. So we had a pretty radical, was it Chef run last night? That one worked out pretty good. Had a great commando run the night before that. Yep, it's always it, lots of little things added up there, exactly. Let's go ahead and do a mercenary run to start. Why not? Why not? Come on up, little birdies. Hesse and X, thanks for the 225 bits. Enjoy your lurk, man. You guys are too damn generous. Uh, 
All right, well, we've killed everything that's spawned so far. We got a little bit of cash to our name. That's nice. Oh, okay, almost lost that. I'm hoping the teleporter is going to be over here, but it's not. you know, if you're going to get piggy bank, you want to get it as first item. Malra, thank you for the 34 consecutive months. Two away from that subscriber hall of fame. You are wonderful. Thank you, thank you. I don't know, man. I don't think I can hang out and farm here. I think we gotta go find our teleporter. Unfortunately, we're gonna be late if I do that. I can't leave three robots worth of XP on the floor. That'll put us way too far behind. Too much. All right, that's a good pickup. It's actually pretty decent too. Wow. Random 2007. Thanks for the 21 consecutive months. Much love. Okay, that was a pretty decent exchange there. We got a lot of items off the shrines, which means we should be... Okay, we're gonna be late out of the first level. But that's not gonna be uncommon. Uh, not gonna be uncommon at this point in the game. We found it. These are the 50 bits. Dear God, man, it's a lot of little pyramids. You guys can imagine them falling into the cup or something. Okay, you know what? I think we can fight down here and it actually works out okay. Yes, please. Um, okay, I may have just got myself killed by saying that. No problem. The red teddy bear resurrects you one time. It's the electrical shock that's going to get me here. Yeah. Whoa there, buddy. Well then. Okay, let's head up here for a minute. This is fine. Oh, man, it's a really bad spawn to get stuck or to have stuff spawn there in the Merc. Okay, well, I'm going to let this one go. We're going to move on to the next one. I'm going to be way too far behind there. It'd be like eight, nine minutes out of the first level. Too much. Dried Lake, perfect spawn, though. Sounds good. Okay, 25 chests there. Word. Good try, good try. They can't all be winners. If I kill these three, we can go back for that chest and then we can uh, clear the rest as we go. I'll explain here in a minute. Actually, let's just go find the teleporter real quick. Alright, healing out of combat's nice. Alright, that shrine's pretty much dead. There's no way for Merc to trace, chase down the imps that spawn out of that. 
Okay, lots of items for 25 or uh, a little more. Okay. Wish we could have cleared as we went a little bit more, but it wasn't meant to be. Oh, it's got to be here, right? Alright, I don't ever remember using this little spot. We're going to try to here. I'll be a little bit late here, then I'll be all right. No problem. What's up, Amy Panda Bear? Nice to see ya. Nothing being able to spawn right here is pretty nice. Hey, what's good, Red Knight of Cleveland? Nice to see you, dude. Wow! Whoa! Okay, so I missed the jump back up to the little shelf there, and I got, uh... Face punched by about 18 crabs at the same time. Let's try that one more time. That, uh, moments like that sum up Risk of Rain gameplay. Welcome to Risk of Rain. Infusion level 1 will be a strong start, but really, Mercenary is all about continued execution. No matter how good your starting build seems, uh, you got to execute really well and get your timings just right. Okay, we see the teleporter. Okay, we learned last time that if you uh, if you have magma worm, this is not a very good spot to to fight. Okay, then I guess I'll be moving along then. Okay, so if I start my dash when he's going down, uh, the splash damage doesn't get me there. That's good.
Wowza, wowza. All right, it's time for me to move now because that, uh, that electrical bird is the one that's going to wreck me. A few outliers spawn over here. That's good. Uh, massive life leech. Okay. That's actually pretty good for me here. We can use our last ability and get uh, some good heals. Neat. Uh, golden gun's decent. Revolver C, welcome. I want to say back to the Dapper Man. Much love. Awesome tuning into your stream last night, sir. Thanks for streaming on the relaxation community. Me and the Prixie had a good time watching you last night. Well, we'll get something here, right? Piggy bank it is. That is better than the life leech, uh, DPS wise. I'm definitely gonna drop down here. Could buy these drones, but I find early drones are almost always a waste. It was so darn weak. Hey there, little fella! Um, med kit or syringe? Let's take the med kit. Clover is great. Definitely I am the Raj, just like anything else in life, it's a process of uh, changing and refining. I've always had uh, pretty much the same goals for streaming, but uh, how to reach those goals has changed greatly over time. Okay. Smart Chopper Gold Gun, we're going to have some deeps here. That's about the single best DPS increase you can get. Messed to go enough? Oh well. Doesn't help me now, does it? Just gotta keep on rolling. Get cut. That's a nice, easy XP there. That's good. Hey, that's pretty good. Okay, I might actually try to do this in two groups. How are you so endlessly positive? Do you want the, the honest truth as I work really hard at it? Maintaining a positive attitude is not the absence of bad thoughts or always feeling good. It's trying to find the, the best in every situation I can. That's hard work. Thanks, uh... A lot of time and practice to try to train yourself to think, uh, think positively and find that silver lining. But let me tell you how thankful I am to be here today, able to share this experience with you. Thank you, thank you. Founding, thanks for the 72 bits, dude. You mad man. I 
did not mean to do that, though. That was not my intention. I'm gonna go off here. I mean, honestly, I think I've greatly changed as a person just over the past five years I've been streaming. Like I said, same goals, just different tools, different outlook. I haven't always been a super positive person. I have my down moments, too. But everything in my life goes towards the, uh, the moments that we go live here. I want to put on the best show I possibly can, provide the uh, most positive outlook, and be as entertaining as I can within, uh, within that parameters. That's my goal every single night. Well, I mean, this got a little bit wacky. Let's be real here. I should not have jumped back there. It's very sketchy. Yeah, charge field's very helpful here. Definitely not Doom Unit, and uh, it's whoa. Okay, I looked over and died there. That's okay. It's uh, it's really easy to uh, when you're when you're like on a roll when you're having a really good time to have all these positive thoughts and get yourself really high on the one side. And then, um, you know, things change or situation changes and, you know, maybe you're not uh, as energetic as before. And it's a lot easier to get on the opposite side of that and go very negative. Try to find the nice balance between uh, hanging out right in the middle and being able to see both sides. SAC, thanks for the 100 bits. Cheers to you. Much love. All right, guys, I've been streaming for just about two and a half hours. I'm going to take my first actual break of the night, which will be my food break. I'm going to have a couple awesome tacos, so I'll be back in about five to eight minutes. Thank you all for your patience during this time. Also going to run our first ad break of tonight. If you allow ads to play on my channel, I greatly appreciate it. If you don't, still very much appreciate your time here. In addition, if you use do any shopping on Amazon.com, please consider using the Amazon affiliate. So to enter through those links, leave the frag.com slash a links at HGN and use a... Uh, do your normal shopping. It's easy peasy. I'll see you guys soon. Be back uh, ready, refreshed, and fed. Thank you for your patience once again.
Alrighty. We have returned. Thank you so much for your patience during the break. I see you there, Gruber. Thanks for that support, man. What do I still have left here? Uh, okay, stats. Achievements. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we got we got all these. Okay, okay, we got loader ones we have to do, I see. Travel for 20,000 feet using the hydraulic gauntlet. Kill the overloading magma worm. Well, is that uh, is that single run with the 20,000 feet? I doubt it. We're not doing a loader run right now, but good to know it's still there. I know I have the uh, Providence monster log too. Let's give Handy a shot here. Twenty K overall. Okay, maybe we'll be doing some uh, loader runs and next week or something. Wowza wowza. I watched uh, Vuvu, which one of my viewers used streaming the relaxation tab, do a handy run before the show started for me today. He lost on the final level, but it was a pretty cool run with repulsion armor and quite a bit of other nice stuff. Okay, let's hope it's over here. Uh, Sockpost, you basically have to do that on the uh, sunken tomb. Uh, there's that area the bottom left. That's your area to drown them. Hey, different things work for different people, Ganon the Great. I know some people that are absolutely killer with the bandit, and I'm not myself. Everybody has their own strengths and prefers different characters, and that's all good. I think one of the best things about Risk of Rain as a game is actually the, uh, the amount of diversity you can get in uh, the play styles between the characters. Okay, let's get one dried lake here, though been all desolate for us except for that one time okay well you know I accept your challenge we got 50 there oh that's a really tough bit of XP to be leaving but you know what that's all right You know, piggy bank uh, less than 30 seconds in is not bad at all. We're going to be getting consistent little bits of money here. Grass bags. Thanks for the 100 bits, man. P appreciate your generosity. Well, if the game insists that I take one more run at the... Desolate forest here. I'm gonna do it. Okay, barbed wire is really nice. So that does uh, damage inside of that circle, which is gonna be uh, be what Handy does most of the time. He does punch for a living. Breezy storm. Just make sure you have fun with it, man. Remember, it's a form of expression. Okay, we're not gonna miss this goat up, guys. Streaming just like anything else is a process that takes a really long time to uh, to refine what uh, what it is. I mean, I've uh, I think greatly improved as an entertainer over time. When I first started streaming, I was uh, a very quiet person. I mean, when I worked in kitchens, of course, doing my callouts and stuff worked fine in a line, but definitely uh, one of the more reserved people uh, in the workplaces where I worked. Even even when I get off stream, I don't talk very much. But uh, the point, point being, it took a long time to gain confidence and learn how to commentate, uh, learn how to uh, read and play at the same time. 
So if you're just a couple weeks in, just enjoy the ride, build those skills. Well, I mean, I want to. Maybe we'll drop back down. Okay, so the things floating around me right now are drones. Each time we kill an enemy, we uh, we gain a drone. They shoot, then bounce back and heal us. Hey, that's a great start, Restorm. Enjoy it, man. Not that I don't love doing this for a living, but really some of uh, my most fond memories when I think back on my career as a streamer is when my stream was very small and you have that really uh, intimate environment and uh, enthusiasm for streaming is uh, a brand new experience. Don't forget to enjoy the ride no matter what happens. Turkleton, thanks for the 100 bits. Cheers to you. Thanks for being a part of the channel for so long. You are awesome. The repunching begins. Okay, so you can do some pretty cool stuff on uh, Handy here. Like, these guys, if you're overcharged, they never have time to clap because you interrupt their attacks. Jellyfish, on the other hand, are a slightly different story. But Handy has a couple attacks. He has Overcharge, which makes him attack faster. Um, he has his Hammer attack, which does that, does AoE smash up. Very dangerous to use the Hammer. Early War Banner is one of the best things you can get. And always important to use your drones as well to heal yourself. We got a great place to uh, hold down the floor here. Look at this, it's beautiful. Out cool. So as you can see, Handy has a really nice knockback with his attack. So since we have the war banner, we have enough attack speed that the enemies can't really even attack us here. We're just Captain Punch and stuff. I like I can use my hammer attack to knock them up here. The repunching begins. You can see the hammer has a really uh, massive radius, but uh, you can knock stuff up in the ground, up in the air, and then it hits you on the way down. So, like on the second level, the uh, the sniper guys or the parents on the sky meadows can can absolutely wreck you if you do that. Um, we'll see what happens here, though. Oh, hey, we got the drones back for that. Okay, so as long as they're uh, getting them as they spawn here. Hey, that worked out way better than I thought it was going to. Well, I think with uh, 530 here, we should maybe go check something out. We should probably get off this level, though. We do have a full rack here. Let's go. Let's go. Thanks for keeping it down for the past 27 months, Rocket Day 2. Much love. You are amazing. All right, let's punch it up here, fellas. You can see our damage is pretty decent right now. Never a bad idea to build up a few drones as a bailout uh, on handy early on. We 
Oh, I'm sure it's out there, Ramafan. All right, just a few more coins for that. I use a wired Xbox 360 controller for almost everything, Tenno. Okay, we need to not fight down here just yet. Yeah. Okay, that's not great either. Okay, this is actually where we want to hold, uh, get our... Whoa there, buddy. If I can get a level up right here. Oh no, I just maybe got myself killed. Not quite, that's good. That's good. What do you think? This is going to be a really good item, right? Attack missiles Mark 1 are definitely not bad. Good. Everything's working good here. Oh, jellyfish. Oh, jellyfish. You saw 4 HP, I honestly believe it. I was not looking, I was just going with the flow, hoping for the best. Hey, that's pretty good. Armor debuff stacking is uh, generally decent. I wish I could bring the wisp over there, but I can't. Wowza! Wowza! Thank you for the drones. Wow, dude. Stop the madness. Sir, I believe that's a welcome back to the dapper. Much love. Thank you, thank you. Dear God, that was pretty trolling. But you know what? We lived. Thallium's pretty good. Right on board, sir. Well, thanks for that continued support. You are awesome. Uh, one more, though, right? Okay. Chance for use items to have double effect. That's great if we get a use item. Well, that's definitely one. We'll go the greedy route because, you know, why not? Why wouldn't you? Man, it's like, hey man, just hold out a second longer. You know you can have 266 in just a second. You're right. Yeah, when is greed uh, not paid off in this stream? It's a great question. I can't recall one time that greed was punishing you. 
get out of here. Skedaddle. All right, we are pretty close to having uh, a war banner here, so we should probably keep that in mind, see if we can generate something good for ourselves. Frozen Tundra is no joke, and those bison are real jerks. All right, no teleporter there, that's for sure. Hey, it actually was right there. Holy crap. Okay, I don't want to fight right here. Not even uh, not even a little bit. I want stuff to spawn over here. Because if it spawns over here, I can punch and stuff it. banner right here though okay that, that'll do that is satisfactory wow war banner is so good on handy I gotta watch out for blighted guys. Holy guacamole. Stack them up, stack them out. Thallium and the uh, armor reduction. A pretty great combo. I'm liking these status effects. So the real trap in any handy run is you'll end up finding good spots like this. You're feeling reasonably well, like you know you can handle whatever the game's gonna throw at you, uh, and then you get like three shot. It all just deteriorates so fast. Get the punching. All right, I mean, so far so good on this handy run here. I'm gonna climb up real quick, cause I can. Hey there, buddy. We're also gonna get the double Colossus bonus here, so I'd say a pretty uh, high percent chance of getting a Neural. And some HP regeneration, some armor. KSWA 1987. I believe that's a welcome back to the damper. Much love and thanks for that subscription. You are wonderful. Hey, hard to go wrong with lemon in that situation, Lady Morris. That's not bad. Any attack speed's good. Crowbar is pretty great, I agree. Man, this uh, Tower of Greed paying off here. We're actually going to forego drones here. Handy has a real problem keeping drones alive.
All right, here we go. We're going to climb the other tower, too, I think. I mean... Why wouldn't we? We could just buy these out. No Winston tonight. He's, uh, he's hanging out elsewhere. He's got other spots to be. Oh, I really wanted that behemoth. It would have been good. That would have been uh, real nice. It's going to drop down now. Let's get out of here in under 20 minutes. Actually feel good about ourselves. Ukulele is not bad. It's no behemoth. Hey, right on, Zula. I think relaxation's uh, a real market on Twitch. A lot of people use uh, Twitch to relax. As we all know with our lurker roll calls and everything here, the lurkers are strong. The real MVPs. Dude, that crit on the hammer, though, I mean, get repunctioning. The repunctioning begins. Oh, I wanted to fall and do the hammer at the same time, but it didn't quite work out the way I thought it would. Not quite how I envisioned it. Good, though. Under 20 minutes to the fourth level. We got a chance here. Wow, Sathonic one. You went there, dude. You took it there. Not cremator would be pretty good. Kind of hard to punch cremator in the face to death. It can be done though. Okay, we're like uh, just a smidge away from leveling here. I think we can keep it cool and collected on this platform. Okay, cool. That was pretty sketchy. I was spamming uh, the drone as fast as I freaking could. Yeah, Handy's never met a problem he couldn't fix by punching it in the face. No mods currently epic guy. Anytime I'm uh, doing modded content, it will uh, usually be uh, in the title of the stream. This is just base game, no artifacts. A classy handy run. I think this is happening. We got this. Wow, I can't believe how well that went. 
I mean, it was really sketchy there at the beginning, but you know, it got it got better. Yeah, any syringes we could get here would be amazing. Any attack speed, for that matter. Crit, um, the wolf helmet would be fine. Golden gun's nice. We don't really have a way to build up money uh, early on the level. No smart shopper here. It helps. But it's not the solution. Temple can be kind of a bummer, too. Yeah, we do have quad life savings. That, that's what we need to do. Just we can keep waiting and spamming out uh, the captain's chest. We can we can make this run last like three or four days. It's gonna be the strap. But I can have all the items eventually. I wonder how obscene the uh, the amount the cost would end up being after a while on that. Um. Okay, I'm gonna go back this way now. There was a drone over there for about a thousand. Mortars aren't bad on handy. Triple mortars actually not. If you're punching with and then getting a mortar right after that it does hit the group. That is true. Tenen. And the second jetpack does give us a, a much higher jump. We got like one and a half jumps now per our, per jump we have. Uh, yeah, I mean, I want the item though. Regrets. Okay, Blighted Clayman is where it starts getting sketchy. They can teleport while we're punching. So not very close to a level here. Just had to build up a few drones there and feel much better already. We do have one barbed wire. Uh, if we didn't have the barbed wire, the bugs are almost impossible. Um, okay. Wow, another two barbed wire. Let's go ahead and spend off the drones here. I don't think I'm willing to give up 65% HP. It's a bit too much. But maybe one time we could do that. Oh, dear God, what have I done? Everything's perfectly okay. Hey, there's a potential for some attack speed increase. Okay, I'm going to jump down immediately because these platforms are actually kind of a nightmare for me. Look at all those items. Or maybe we could fight right here. Hmm. 
Okay, missile launcher guy there tells me I should probably be moving along. Let's go ahead and have ourselves a drop down here, huh? Dennis, this is handy. He's the uh, the punching robot. much there. Everything's going exactly according to plan. And now that we have charge field generated, that's going to really help the drone production. Big time. Whew, that helped out a lot. <laughs> That's what I needed, a fifth life savings. Good. Whoa! There, buddy. Let's, uh, let's heal that back, please. Missile launching uh, champions are the real threat here. That is not where I wanted my war banner, but you know what? We're alive. Was there even anything back here? It had to be something, right? Let's take a little breather here. Woo! Only 570 here. This is definitely not a looping run. This is a we might be able to win a standard run here for lucky type run. Hey, there's some health regeneration. That's helpful. It gets way harder than that, Dennis. That's just the uh, showing max, but it'll continue to get harder. It gets there the quickest on monsoon difficulty, which is what we are playing. You know, Sommering's pretty good. I'm actually going to tank this, because it's, uh, it's another way to generate damage in groups. Don't really even want to buy drones here because I know what's going to happen if we buy drones. They're not going to be good. What are you doing there, little fella? <laughs> He's just doing a little shimmy. He's trying to avoid losing this fight. It's not going to happen. Okay, that's nice. Attack Missile Mark 2. 
Another attack missile mark one. Interesting. Smart shopper, finally. Uh, that could actually be really helpful. Um, wow. Sawmerang's better. All right, guys, we're definitely going to the last level here. It needs to happen. We got a chance at winning. card seems good. Okay, drone number two. Double use is pretty nice. guys are not fun for me. Okay, that's where we start. We got a few more to activate here. Let's just go activate all the things. Go find a way to get money and then uh, get back here. Gonna have a hard time just man fighting. There's a third drone. Deal. You know, it's just 25 HP. I wouldn't I wouldn't read too much into it. Uh, triple rusty jetpack, nice. Da -da -da -da. I can't believe I'm actually going into the medical facility with the intention of healing by opening these. Nice. What a life. Sir Ramok, thanks for the 11 consecutive months. One away from a year. Amazing. Thank you. You are awesome. Probably shouldn't have done that. Yeah, now we're going to have to wait here. Well, I got to find somewhere to fight so we can actually make some money here. Got to give it a go.
Well, you know, we gave it a good try there. I think we needed even more AOE damage. We need more uh, on touch, maybe like a Tesla coil or something. Good run, good run. Word, thanks for the five consecutive months. Much love. Trying to reflect, uh, yeah, it felt good. Uh, the run felt good most of the way through, but it just it never quite got there. Brungy, welcome back to the damper. Thanks so much for something with Twitch Prime. Much love. All right, guys, tell you what, I had an absolutely amazing week of streaming. I feel like I've been fighting something off all week, and I feel really run down today. But I had a really good time for the time I was here. Uh, we got a lot of hours in this week. I had an amazing time. Just thank you, everyone, for being here. Going to host another person from the Relaxation Community tab. Uh, Valhalla, thanks for the 11 consecutive months. Much love. We're hosting uh, in-game blues, uh, playing faster than lights. Uh, another chill streamer that I found on the relaxation tab. Feel a little bit better tomorrow. I'm throwing a few rounds of pinball or something. No promises, but uh, thank you guys for another absolutely amazing week. I could not wait to get back into it again. Much love. Hope you guys enjoy in game blues. I certainly enjoyed the little bit I watched uh, over the past couple days. Don Jando, welcome to the damper as well. You're subscribing while I'm ending the broadcast. You guys are nuts. I love you all so much. See you soon. <laughs>